Hey guys, and welcome to another brand new video. In this video, we actually have somewhat of a surprising, actually confirmed restart that actually kind of snuck its way on in as of last night. So I'm going to go talk to you guys about that, that actually a lot of you guys might have a chance to go get your PlayStation 5 console. Like I said, that does seem like it is confirmed as all as well. We also have a lot of other various restacks we'll be kind of watching a lot throughout the weekend, but kind of just giving you guys the day-to-day -day updates when it comes to them. So all around, should be looking and feeling pretty good when it comes to stack and restacks and all that good stuff, which I'm actually pretty happy about. And as well, just all around, I guess we get to be back in the certain groove, I guess, of another restacking week and ideally have a pretty good time. So hope you guys are all ready to have, hopefully, a pretty good time yourselves. And as well, if any of you guys are brand new, make sure you guys are subscribed with the notifications on. As well, for the brand new PlayStation 5 giveaway, we also got to keep on reminding you guys we keep on having links down below for the brand new awesome, awesome, awesome Samsung. Let's put it like the best thing you probably get for your PS5, Xbox, and all that good stuff. Link down below, you get a bunch of money off too as well. If you guys want to click on it and check it on out, link down below. I know we've been mentioning a lot on the channel itself, but it is a cool deal and pretty much like the pinnacle, I would say, of everything. So make sure you guys check that on out down below. We may even try our best to go give it out, give one out of like actually enough. If you guys go click on the link and stuff and all that. If you guys will on to, we have the Twitter and Twitch room down below, the Weeble and Coinbase down below, and everything else always down below. Amazon links and junk. And leave a like if you guys wanna, and let's go and dive it into the video itself. So like I want to remind you guys, we actually do seem to actually have a confirmed restock going on in general. So I'm just letting you guys know. Good thumbs up. I like it. I love it. This is looking pretty spicy. So I had a chance to go and kind of talk about this and showcase up over here. So you guys can see my goofy face on the left side over there from some of the thumbnails we've been working on. But we actually do have this. I just kind of edited a little bit so make sure you guys don't show any names. But... Funny enough, we had a little bit of a sneaky PlayStation Direct, I believe, that actually went and is actually going on as of today. So we had two people go message me about this, and I didn't really see a lot of tweets or messages or other stuff as well, uh, just from anyone else. So I'm assuming it should be all good from what we've seen, but if you guys want to. Go and uh, check your emails right now on the promotions, on the spam folder, on the normal inbox, like whatever you guys want to do, your old emails or whatever it may or may not be, but be on the lookout for because it, it does seem like today seems like it's looking pretty juicy for the may 31st today uh at 11 a.m pacific 12 a.m mountain uh or i guess 12 p.m i guess technically uh 1 p.m central 2 p.m est and as well if you guys want to go check your emails it does seem like we have once again another playstation direct and it does kind of seem nice because we just keep on seeing these consoles like churning and churning and churning and churning and churning and we've had like four PlayStation Directs if you include this one. So two things to know. Number one is obviously if you guys got the email, go check your emails right now and go and see as the reminder. But as well, uh, if you guys did, make sure you guys just access the event at the same proper normal time. It's like on the actual email it's, uh, itself. And then as you guys go and do that, uh, you guys have to enter into the normal like individual queue. And ideally, we've been seeing a lot of folks out there that actually have been getting uh, all the consoles. Like we've actually been having a pretty good stint, I would say, for PlayStation Drex going good and flowing good and just all around a lot, like a lot of really nice stuff. We do enjoy it. Like it's always good. Good thumbs up. So as we have been watching all that stock with it, be on the lookout. Uh, as all well, too, when sometimes we've been seeing like a double whammy. We haven't seen it in quite some time, but there has been many instances too where we have like a private invite one, like this is like the private one uh, for emails and such, and then we have a public drop after the fact. So in case you guys want to follow Twitter or subscribe to the channel, we'll let you guys know if we see a public queue and if some stuff kind of flows on in. But this is actually confirmed. It's all kind of nice to see. As well, I guess it kind of snuck on into us. Like maybe because it was Memorial Day and people were chilling, not checking their emails, which you should on your days off and just relax as well. So, uh, yeah, <laughs> all around good stuff with that. And on top of that, always a reminder, please make sure you guys are signed up for the PlayStation Direct as well. Just basically go to Google PlayStation Direct. And you guys can go from there and get your stock. So at least we have some kind of nice good news to start off this week. And as well with Memorial Day, this week will probably be a little bit more on the awkward side and kind of chiller side. But... Be on the lookout for the times itself. Follow the instructions. It should be pretty easy. I'm not sure if it will only be the PlayStation Horizon and PlayStation uh, like Digital Horizon bundles or general stuff. I'd say just be on the lookout either way. At least we do have something confirmed. Now, part two of this is also on still the continuation of all the other drops. So we've been kind of covering this up a lot throughout the weekend slash these past few days. But I just want to remind you guys, we still have been seeing instances of PlayStation 5 bundles still being up in stores. Now, once again... We do actually have some other confirmed drops throughout the week. If you guys missed it, we could watch the weekly video and all of that or whatever. But we have other stuff in other locations we'll be watching throughout this week. So if you guys want to check, like I, 
I, like I usually say people just want to be done and like, you know, just pay a little extra money and all that type of stuff, whatever, then sure, that's fine. Like, why not? But like, I mean, it's a bundle. I mean, there's going to be other options. I don't know. Like I'd probably win for like Walmart throughout the week later. Um, if anything, uh, mainly because you don't have to pay the extra bundle prices and stuff. But either way, it is still news. And I always want to report on the news, even though it's kind of lame, like whatever. But when it does come to stock with it, GameStop, like I said, go be on the lookout. A lot of stores are still having stock. We were even seeing people as of yesterday getting consoles and getting drops. You just have to call your store, check your store, and see. Apparently, some of you just so even apparently some of these stores don't even have the signs up anymore. Like you know how on initial drops or drops they'll have like you know the signs and be like, oh, do this, do this, do this. Uh, but apparently, some of these stores are just like you just have to ask at this point. So either call or just walk in the store and get them stuck with it. Uh, maybe people are just having bad receptions. I did see. I think this one was way worse received. And if you guys have seen a lot of my videos, we had just a lot of like little various mediocre things that have happened with it so maybe they're just being more i guess defensive on the stock or just want their employees to have like rude comments or whatever it is but we still have been seeing lots of stores still having stock and usually the bundles kind of sit so We'll probably be seeing it for the next few days, even still. Uh, someone actually checked his store yesterday and said their store had six, st six stocks still left. So, like, I mean, it's still flowing, it's still going. There's a lot of stores. It's probably worth checking almost all of them to go and see. Now, for other little things to mention on the Best Buy side. So, uh, as we've kind of been covering throughout this weekend, Best Buy does kind of seem like it's more on the tail end. Like, when it comes to stock and stock movement. It doesn't seem like the best you know when it comes to stock uh so like because we've been doing it for like maybe i'd say like nine ten days or so like, of like pretty consistent like stock being divvied on out like you know like first days like you just have it like everywhere and then like first like few weeks is always like this and then like after a while it's kind of like this <laughs> so but we still have been seeing pe reports of people getting the best buy um like using the app glitch as per usual just download the app Type in the SKU unit of the PlayStation itself. Check and see if it shows as unavailable or out of stock. That means the store should have stock. And you guys just go drive with the stock. We have usually been seeing that around one hour before open and like one hour before close. So as always, a reminder on that one. We usually do have the Xbox as well linked down below. So that's still on the tapered end. So we'll give you guys more details throughout the week or if we see more stuff tomorrow. Uh, I mean, as of like yesterday, we didn't really see that many folks. Like GameStop, we did. Best Buy, really not. But as of at the same time, a lot of people were pretty chill yesterday either way for the holidays so uh, we can kind of go from that as well either way ps Rex, make sure you get check the emails and as well keep on checking the links down below for the samsung <laughs> itself for the part like i said probably the best monitor for uh the gaming consoles so cool stuff now other stuff as well as on the target side now uh, we're gonna wait for probably more information on the day mainly because for this usually target we sometimes do get some employee leaks and stock arrivals or internal systems if we have a chance to so we're gonna be watching the best we possibly can but when it does come to stock with it, uh, basically we'll go and see. It's overdue this week, uh, as we kind of covered out in yesterday's videos. So we'll let you guys know if we see any in target employees reach out with stock or movement or warehouse movement or anything of the sort. Mainly because we just want you guys to go get your consoles. Uh, so we'll give you guys more details if we see it. But as of right now, uh, it's kind of on the same thing for Best Buy where it's either kind of tapering off or whatever. Uh, you guys still can go check your stores if you guys would like. There's nothing ever wrong with that. About when it does come to stock and stock movement, like I said, uh, it's probably just way more worthwhile to check GameStop, PS Direct, and Best Buy for the week itself. Amazon. As we keep on mentioning throughout these past few days, Amazon is a little bit on the overdue side, uh, more on the PS5 digital side. Normal disc editions, not so much. Xbox Series X is overdue. So we'll kind of keep you in the loop. There's nothing super crazy. We have the links down below if you always want to check. You guys can, but it's kind of up to you guys. Uh, and well, Walmart, as you guys have probably heard, we might actually see a website update. Nothing super confirmed, but we'll be on the lookout for it to see. We'll have some more information for that throughout the rest of the week. And then Microsoft stores, keep on checking online if you guys want to. Uh, and online, we keep mentioning that they have not done any PlayStation 5 disc or digital drops at all. So keep that in mind, too, as well when it comes to stock and stock bundles and all that stuff or whatever. So uh, be on the lookout for them. They usually do their nice little drops or ruskies, and they're just overdue. Uh, as, as we kind of been mentioned these past few days, Costco, not as overdue. We can still be on the lookout for them. They've done a few bundles and store openings, so kind of not so much. Sam's Club is slightly more on the overdue side, if you just want to look, but more so on the Xbox side. New egg for the day-to-day -day shuffles, always just a nice casual reminder. And as well, all the usual mid-tier places. And also, we haven't still really been seeing too much moving, as we've been mentioning, for Myers, haven't seen too much. Uh, the Kroger's, uh, Smith's, Fred Myers is still overdue for online. 
Haven't seen too much, though, and same with Kroger's in stores uh, and also BJ's wholesalers in stores. We haven't really been seeing so much. Same with Military Online, Military Walk-Ins, PC Richards, Staples, HEBs, Belks. We just haven't really been seeing too much. We saw a lot like two weekends ago, and at least this last week, we had a lot more on the GameStop Best Buy side. So, you know, I'd rather have the bigger retailers than not. So, thank you guys all so much for watching. Make sure you guys are subscribed with the notifications on. As well, make sure you guys keep on checking the best and probably get your free reservations and free money with it with the links down below. And as well, we have the Twitter and Twitch stream down below, Amazon links the Weeble Coinbase is all the usual solid stuff down below. And I appreciate you guys all so much for watching. Let's have a great week.